Jay from Tinje Media. Good morning, how are you? Well, thank you, Excellency. How thank you, you very much. So, I'm okay. All right. From Great. That is uh, your uh, reason for the travel. Uh, we are seeing, coming at the time when we are ready for foreign travel is being questioned by some stakeholders. Well, first and foremost, let's make the position very clear that um, it's a tradition for in our region, SADC, on our continent, that when a new president comes into office, he or she needs to pay cutters calls to neighbors. I'm sure you know Zambia has eight neighbors. So I've only done South Africa, Botswana, so today I'm going to Congo DR. Congo DR is important because President Shisekedi is the chairman of the African Union. So hopefully soon I'll be visiting the chairman of SADI, who is President Chakwera, next door here. So this will go on for a while until we have visited all our neighbors, mainly to reinforce good neighborliness, security, peace, and of course, trade and investment. Never leave that behind, because that's what will change our country and your welfare. So I am going there for a courtesy call, two, to visit the chairman of the African Union, three, to talk about our common interest issues, you are aware. It's not a secret that Congo and uh, Congo DR and Zambia have issues in the border in Chiengi, in uh, Chief Puta, so Chief, Chief Puta, Chiengi, Chief Kaputa, Chief Susama, and all the way up to Lake Tanganyika. We have issues that are old issues there. So we'd like to resolve those issues. Lastly, to talk about trade and investment. I think that story you know very well. And the new issue re with regard to climate change, there's a move away from fossil fuels to electric cars. And one of the things we're discussing with President Shisekedi is to use our resources, copper, cobalt, tantalite, lithium, in the electric car business, which is the future of motor vehicles. And we two countries have a lot of resources endowed between us, Congo, DR, and ourselves. So we want to organize ourselves so that we can start bringing investments that will take our place, will allow us to take our place in the new electric car industry as the gravitation takes place. Wonderful, isn't it? We want to establish the electric car batteries right here in our country, the two countries. So we are talking. I'm sure the official show for official business is what you know, is about electric uh, batteries, electric car batteries. Wonderful, isn't it? Would you have a problem with that? Would anyone in this country who wants the country to be reorganized have a problem with that? Absolutely not. Unless somebody wants to talk politics. That's okay. Democracy allows those guys to talk. They're welcome to talk. We keep focused so we can take care of the economy, which will take care of you, and take care of the sick, the old, the young, and the students who need a lot of things, a lot of support. Like I got support when I was a student. I guess now I've given you a full story around why we are going to this country. So this will continue for a while, and obviously it doesn't mean neglecting the domestic responsibilities. Mm. You're not hearing me, sir. Another question. Happy to take another question. Yes, Your Excellency. Uh, there is uh, allegations of an invisible hand from the executive. Sorry? Allegations of an invisible hand from the executive in matters of uh, election uh, at parliamentary level that the courts have been pronouncing themselves <laughs> on. And uh, in addition to that, sir, uh, your uh, petition uh, against the former president's immunity as well. I'm laughing. Why am I laughing? A lot of the UPND candidates eh, lost their petitions in the same court. And the UPND members started saying that, oh, HH is doing nothing. How come we are losing cases in court? I'm sure you followed that. Now, a few cases are lost. The opposite is the, is the top now. It means there's a balance. Self-balancing act. That's my answer. The immunity is not a subject. 
it's not a subject for me to address. Uh, why would I address that subject now? Our focus is to rebuild the country's economy. But people are free to talk. They are free. That's the freedom we've granted people four months ago. You wouldn't ask the president then the questions you ask me. You'd be scared yourself. Now it shows that we've brought the freedom. I'm sure you feel free. You feel free with me. I feel free with you. You can ask me any question you want. Any question. There's no question that is taboo for me. Any question is okay. But what we want is to enshrine that freedom. One side of the coin is freedom. Eh? as per Bill of Rights. The other side is the rule of law. The rule of law. You took something from the state, bring it back. So that we can take care of those who need to be taken care of. There was a question here. Yes, you have monopolized the question. Now that yeah. you have talked about freedom, freedom, freedom. Uh, they have given flag. themselves through us. They elected us, then we give them the freedom. There has been a red flag, uh, flag uh, Bring the information. Bring the information. Take it to the Anti-Corruption Commission. You know a minister? Really surprised? Under the UBND government, who is corrupt? I encourage you to take the information to the ACC, Drug Enforcement Commission, Financial Intelligence Center. You can go directly to DPP. That's the freedom you have now. Go and report them. I've encouraged you to go and report them to those institutions. And the institutions should do their job professionally. You should be happy, feel happy. You know anything of the old government, the PF government, report. Anything with the UPND government, report. No sacred cow in the fight against corruption. Corruption of the past, of today, of tomorrow, will be pursued vigorously. Because corruption is a thief, steals your money, and steals someone else's money. So you don't have to raise that issue with me, but you have raised it. My answer is that go and report. Very free, you're encouraged. You need fewer money to go there? I'm happy to provide fewer money. Thank you. Thank you. Anything else? I think uh, the lady's position. <laughs> huh? So uh, the Kasumina Munda Road, I know it was in the commission of Kasumina Munda Road. Yes. Between Congo and Zambia. Yes. Is it part of the Come again. You said it's, it's yet to be? The commission. Is it part uh -huh. of the discussion of the council? My hand is ready to sign off that project. That's the way to go. Opens up the route. Congo, Mwense area, bridge there, road up to up to Nakonde. Fantastic. That is what we are here for, to open up the country for investment, for trade. And we value that road. It's long overdue. The people who didn't pay attention to it, immediately we came into office, we touched base. We talked with my counterpart. We are ready. We are even late. But not that, uh, that alone. We are looking at uh, Kolwezi, Lumwana Sorwezi Road. We're looking at that road. We want it. It will happen. But we'll do these roads in a smarter way, in a cheaper way. Two, three, in a way that does not create new debt. Because our country is already debt burden. Smart, isn't it? Very smart. Very important that we do roads like that so that we open up the country. And you see when that road is done properly, there will be first and foremost an economic zone around there, fantastic. And we can look at our manganese in Mansa, all those areas, and begin to create value. This is, this is where you should be spending time asking me questions, my friend. Ask me, look at this lady, she's very smart. Those are the questions, those are the issues the country and the people are looking for. Things that will grow the economy, things that will bring more money, things that will allow us to sell more. By the way, I'm going there. I'm negotiating a market for our products here. I'm the chief salesman, isn't it? I said so. We are living by that. Anything else, guys? Feel free. You are free. Anything else? We are friends. We are done for today? Yes, sir. Thank you. Have a good day. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you very much.